Hey guys, welcome to the shop. A while back, I carved up this helmet with the chainsaws. I cleaned it up with my flap sander and stuff like that. And I've kind of held on to it for quite some time. I've really been wanting to uh, carve a design into it. So today we're going to use the Fordham Flex shaft, some saber tooth bits, and uh, see if we can put something cool in the sides of this helmet. Be sure to stick around and check it out. Like I said, carved this helmet up a while back. It's just out of a piece of pine. I think I've had it kicking around for about a year or so. Uh, I carved the inside out with the chainsaw and got the basic shape. And then I took my angle grinder with a flat disc sander on there and just, you know, smoothed it all out for the most part. There's a few chainsaw marks, but I'm not going to go back and, and do anything about those. Today, I've got a couple designs drawn on here and I want to try to do like relief carving you know so the designs will be sticking out off the helmet and i'm not sure if i'm gonna have enough material so we'll kind of just see what happens you know if this works it works if it doesn't well it doesn't maybe we'll get something a little better next time but right now i've got the ace of spades drawn on the one side and on the other side we've got a skull with a cigar hanging out of his mouth so the plan is to uh, start removing material around the carvings I'm going to be doing that with the quarter inch hand piece with my flex shaft here hooked to my Fordham flex shaft and this burr from Sabretooth. This long cylinder burr. Now I'm hoping with that I will be able to remove material around the carving and kind of feather it out. Kind of get it ready to, uh, or sorry, around the design and feather away a lot of material. Then we'll be getting into the quarter inch shaft. This is not the quarter though, this is the eighth. <laughs> this is the quarter. And I'll be grabbing the eighth inch shaft with this flame bit, flame burr. And we'll be going through and really starting to do some detail work and seeing if we can uh, make this side look like an ace of spades. And well, see if we can draw the detail out for this skull smoking a cigar. I don't know, we'll see what happens. So, let me throw a dust mask on and uh, get started.
Well guys, just a short video on just a little project I've been kind of wanting to do some detail work on. There's the helmet. We got some black walnut or dark walnut stain on there after carving it up. I'm going to get it in here close enough. You guys can see he's got a cigar hanging out of his mouth, a little smoke coming up. Now this is the back of the helmet here. So this is the front coming around. And we've got card stuck in the side. Just kind of goofing around here, you know. Thought about doing a gun back here. I don't know. Maybe in the future we will. We'll see. I'm going to let this stain dry. And this will be one of them little projects I just come back to, I think, once in a while. Kind of want to add different carvings to it, maybe. You know, maybe get the whole thing covered in skulls and different stuff. I don't know yet. We'll see what happens. I uh, definitely, definitely like how these came out. You know, something different from what I'm usually doing. So, I think it's good to try new stuff. I don't know if you guys can tell. But they are raised. It's like I removed material so, like, the skull is raised off the helmet. The same thing for the card. See, it's kind of raised off. It's a little tough to see in the camera, I think, but you guys get the idea. So hopefully that'll inspire you guys to uh, do something new, try something different. Uh, be creative, you know, be creative with your art, whether it's with a chainsaw or whether it's with, uh, you know, some power carving tools, but try something new and, uh, and go for it, you know, draw up a design and just have at it, have fun with it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Just kind of a quick carve here at the bench. Nothing crazy. Be sure to give it a thumbs up. Hit subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll see you guys next time.